fans crazy as Prince William, Kate are more proper royal than Prince Harry and Meghan with PDA. While Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are more demonstrative with each other in public, especially since stepping down as senior royals, Prince William and Kate Middleton are still very connected to each other, a body language expert told Fox News. Body language expert Blanca Cobb said William and Kate are more proper and royal. They'll still touch each other on occasion, they'll still look in each other's eyes, and they'll smile, Cobb said of the Prince and Princess of Wales, who recently visited the U.S. for the first time in eight years. That synchronicity, or the degree of the smile, lets us know that they're still very much connected to one another. So although their public or PDA might be a little bit different, they're still a very connected and regal couple. Conversely, Cobb said the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are very PDA heavy. They're constantly holding hands, they're touching each other's back, he's hugging her, they're constantly together, which is great, which is what you want when you see a loving couple, she explained. At the Ripple of Hope Awards in Manhattan, where the couple was honored Tuesday, Cobb said, They both had this level of happiness that was more magnetic than I've seen in the past. She said they're living on their own terms and seem to no longer feel pressure to try to conform to royal protocols. They don't feel the construct of being a part of the firm, as they refer to the royal family. They're not so tied to that institution where there's a level of relation that comes across when they're interacting with each other or with the public at the event. Even from the beginning of their relationship and when they were senior royals, they broke the rules regarding PDA, Cobb said. They were renegades with their affection, but that's what felt good to them. That's what felt natural to them as a couple, and it was important to them to express their love in that manner. Whether they're at a royal event or meeting with crowds, Harry and Meghan almost never seem to shy away from making their love for each other loud and clear. They're not afraid to hold hands. They don't mind showing their emotions. Royal photographer Mark Stewart recently told Meghan is used to being touchy-feely, and Harry's the same. Harry has always been tactile, though. The last reunion, the brothers and their wives looked at the tributes and flowers left in memory of the late queen. Loisel said while Harry and Meghan walked side by side, holding hands, Prince William and Kate, who are traditionally more reserved, were noticeably less tactile, keeping a little distance as they walked. Rather than being an indication of disconnection, the pairs, William and Kate's purposeful walk, arms loosely by their sides, reflects the seriousness of the occasion and indicates a couple who is confident in their roles and may not feel the need to constantly check in. However, whilst the couple retain a more formal appearance, reflecting their position as royals, they do reconnect. Walking in sync, Prince William placing his hand on Kate's back, providing a sense of reassurance. Despite perceived tensions, William and Kate know their roles and what's expected of them as senior members of the royal family. Recently, the Princess of Wales helped her husband highlight environmental causes during last week's three-day tour of Boston, glamorously culminating with the Earthshot Prize Awards. Princess Kate personally presented the Clean Our Air Prize on stage at MGM Music Hall and looked on with love as Prince William gave the closing speech.